multi-engine airplane weight and balance computations. Weight and balance computations for small multi-engine airplanes are similar to those discussed for single-engine airplanes. Figure 4-9 shows an example of weight and balance data for a typical light twin-engine airplane. The airplane in this example was weighed to determine its basic empty weight and EWCG. The weighing conditions and results are fuel drained, oil full, right wheel scales 1,084 pounds, they are 8 pounds, left wheel scales 1,148 pounds, they are 8 pounds, nose wheel scales 1,202 pounds, they are 14 pounds. Determine the loaded CG, beginning with the basic M2 weight and EWCG, and using a chart such as the one in Figure 4-11, the loaded weight and CG of the aircraft can be determined. The aircraft is loaded as shown here. Fuel 140 gallons or 840 pounds. Front seats 320 pounds. Row 2 seats 310 pounds. Forward baggage 100 pounds. Aft baggage 90 pounds. Chart method using weight, arm, and moments. Make a chart showing the weight, arm, and moments of the airplane and its load. The loaded weight for this flight is 5,064 pounds and the CG is located at 42.47 inches aft of the datum. To determine that the weight and the CG are within the allowable range, refer to the CG range chart of Figure 4-12. Draw a line vertically upward from 42.47 inches from the datum and one horizontally from 5,064 pounds. These lines cross inside the envelope showing that the airplane is properly loaded. Determining the CG in percent of Mach Refer again to Figure 4-10 and 4-11. The loaded CG is 42.47 inches aft of the datum. The Mach is 61.6 inches long. The Lemach is located at station 20.1. The CG is 42.47 minus 20.1 equals 22.37 inches aft of the Lemach. Use this formula. CG in percent Mach equals CG in inches from Lemach times 100 all over Mach. Substitute the value to 22.37 times 10 all over 61.6, the answer will be 36.3% Mach. The loaded CG is located at 36.3% of the mean aerodynamic cord. The chart method using weight and moment indexes. As mentioned in the previous chapter, Anything that can be done to make careful pre-flight planning easier makes flying safer. Many manufacturers furnish charts in the POH or AFM that use weight and moment indexes rather than weight, arm, and moments. They further help reduce errors by including tables of moment indexes for the various weights. Consider the loading for this particular flight. Cruise fuel flow equals 16 gallons per hour. Estimated time en route equals 2 hours 10 minutes. Reserve fuel equals 45 minutes equals 12 gallons. Total required fuel equals 47 gallons. 
The pilot completes a chart like the one in figure 4 13. Using moment indexes from tables in figure 4 14 to 4 16, the moments divided by 100 in the index column are found in the charts in figure 4 14 through 4 16. If the exact weight is not in the chart, interpolate between the weights that are included. When a weight is greater than any of those shown in the charts, add the moment indexes for a combination of weights to get that which is desired. For example, to get the moments divided by 100 for the 320 pounds in the front seats, add the moment index for 100 pounds to that for 220 pounds. This gives the moment index of 336 for 320 pounds in the front seats. Use the moment limits versus weight envelope in figure 4-17 on page 4-8 to determine if the weight and balance conditions will be within allowable limits for both takeoff and landing at the destination. The moment limits versus weight envelope is an enclosed area on a graph of three parameters. The diagonal line representing the moment divided by 100 crosses the horizontal line representing the weight at the vertical line representing the CG location in inch aft of the datum. When the lines cross inside the envelope, the aircraft is loaded within its weight and CG limits. Take off 3,781 pounds and 4,310 moment divided by 100. Landing 3,571 pounds and 4,050 moment divided by 100. Locate the moment divided by 100, diagonal line for 4310, and follow it down until it crosses the horizontal line for 3781 pounds. These lines cross inside the envelope at the vertical line for a CG location of 114 inches aft of the datum. The maximum allowable takeoff weight is 3,900 pounds and this plane weights 3,781 pounds. The CG limits for 3,781 pounds are 109.8 to 117.5. The CG of 114 inches falls within these allowable limits.